Hey guys, so today I'm sharing my personal nail polish collection with you all. I'm going to be going through each polish and then showing you some of my all-time favorites. This rack is my most used favorite brand polish. This is my secondary rack with my gels and all different random brands. And then I have my cup for my nail stripers. So starting at the top, this is all of my OPI polish. It takes up the top row and then one on the second row. Then you have all of my China Glaze polish. It makes up the second row and then half of the third row here. This is my favorite brand, if you can't tell. Then next we have Julep, which I wish I had more of. And then I just have one from Better London. And then it starts my Orly collection, which I also love. Then I have all of my SE polish. These are amazing colors. And then I have all of my Sinful colors, which is mostly glitter. A few from CoverGirl. And then this brand here is just called Nail Polish. It was in a gift set. Next is Sally Hansen Extreme Wear and then New Bar. Now I wanted to show you guys some of my top favorites out of my collection. This is OPI When Monkeys Fly, gorgeous gold glitter. Next is this really beautiful deep purple. It's called Do You Have This Color in Stockholm? It's a really pretty medium creamy purple that I'm obsessed with. This next one here, all time favorite, you've heard me rave about it. This is Flip Flop Fantasy, the most gorgeous neon coral orange you will ever need in your life. Next, I have my all-time favorite from Orly. This is a bright neon called Glow Stick. The most beautiful bright neon yellow lime green is perfect for summer. And this is my only one from Better London. This is called the Black Knight. It is a jelly base, which is a black base with purple, pink, blue, and gold glitters all throughout. It is so gorgeous when you apply it. Next is my all-time favorite from Essie. This is called Butler Please. It's a gorgeous, bright, fluorescent, kind of medium blue shade. It's a cream formula, and this cannot be beat. It's the most gorgeous polish I own. Absolutely love it on the nails and the toes. This one is Bikini Sotini from Essie. It's a gorgeous powdery blue with a little bit of sparkle. Then one of my favorite lilacs in my collection is this one from Orly. It's called Lollipop. It is a beautiful cream polish that's opaque in one coat. Absolutely love that one. Then I have my favorite rose gold color of life. This is called Rage from Orly. It's so beautiful. Now this is my secondary rack where I keep my LA colors on the bottom here. I just have two from Zoya, then starts my Gelays by China Glaze collection. This is my favorite gel line. I have one gel from Essie, some Milani, some Wet n Wild from Fergie, Wet n Wild Bash Dry line, a few more different kinds of gel. And then these top three rows are completely random, a mix of Wet n Wild, Maybelline, NYC, pretty much everything. I have my favorite gel. This is Flip Flop Fantasy from China Glaze. And then another beautiful fluorescent neon. This is called Pink Voltage. Then I have two from Wet n Wild. Stand the test of lime and till slowly and see. So gorgeous. Then I have the most beautiful silver glitter. These are bar glitters. This is called New Year's Kiss. It's the Fergie line from Wet n Wild. These are two amazing products from Gelability. It's a bonder and then a mixer that you can mix with any nail polish and it turns it into gel. I can't live without these guys. I definitely recommend. Then I have one of my favorites from the Mega Last line from Wet n Wild. I need a refreshment. It's the most gorgeous, cool, minty blue. Then I have my nail stripers. You guys know I rave about these. I go through them pretty quickly because they dry up pretty fast, but these are the ones I'm working with now, and I have a, have a lot of backups. I have a couple different brands here. These are my two top favorite brands. The Art Deco line from LA Colors. I am completely obsessed with this. I love the brush. It's a shorter brush. It's easier to work with. And this brand is Kiss, the nail art paints. You guys know I love these as well. I have everything from greens to golds to blacks to whites to silvers. 
because black, white, and silver and gold are the most used from my collection. Definitely recommend these guys if you want to get into nail art. So that's it for my entire nail polish collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you did. And also you can click here on the screen now to subscribe and check out my latest video. And I'll see you all in my next one. Bye guys.